Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Amal Alagrubi. I'm a filmmaker and I'm on my way to becoming one of the greatest filmmakers of all time. I hope you can join me on my journey. One big part of my journey has been teaching myself how to write scripts. I started off in documentary. I had no idea how to write short films. I had no idea how to write feature films. And I have an ultimate goal and that is to become an auteur. And that's somebody whose voice is quite distinct in their cinema. And oftentimes the directors that are auteurs write their own scripts. How could I do that if I didn't even know how to write a script? So I used a website called ScreenCraft just to say, I am not paid to do this. No one has asked me to do this. I am just very grateful for my experience on ScreenCraft and I wanted to share it with you. What is ScreenCraft? Well, it is a website and that website allows you to take part in script competitions in every genre. So they've got action, comedy, drama. Not only do you take part in these competitions, but you can request feedback. They have a bunch of readers who are experienced, who read a lot of scripts and they give you this feedback. It was in February, 2016 that I decided to dedicate myself to a whole year of writing scripts. And I wrote eight scripts within that year. And I said, I'm going to hit every single one of those deadlines. And these deadlines are about a month and a half apart. So it's like comedy. Okay. Come on, turn out comedy. Okay. Drama. Okay. We're writing something for drama sci-fi. Okay. We're writing something for sci-fi. I believe the fee at the time was maybe a hundred, 150 bucks but I decided that they were going to be my teachers. They were the ones who were going to hold me accountable. So if I didn't write a script and I didn't make the deadline, I would just, I'd be failing myself. So I'm like, nope, you, you need to write this. You need to submit it and you need to get the feedback. The first script I ever wrote was a fantasy comedy. It was a little bit strange. I really love fantasy and sci-fi. That's kind of my favorite genre to watch. But I was like, how would I fare writing this? I didn't know quite what I was doing. And I can tell you it was a hundred percent poo poo caca. The paragraphs were too long. The dialogue was all over the place. There were like 20 characters in my script. Screencraft came back to me and said, could you shorten your descriptions? For example, because producers don't like reading long, lengthy kind of chunks of text. And I was like, okay. So I knew that for the next time I was writing a script. So the question becomes, how did I benefit from all this feedback? Back. Well, I realized that no matter who the reader was, I always got the same notes back. My number one strength became my creativity. Anyone who read any of my scripts was always like, oh, this is highly imaginative or very highly creative or very original. And so I realized, you know what, like this is my forte. Like I, I pick those kind of and that's what I want. And of course I realized that my biggest weakness was characterization. You know, they would come back and say, I'm not so convinced by the protagonist, your uh, character arc is a little weak. I feel like they're really underdeveloped. They're a bit one dimensional. And so I just realized that that's something I really needed to improve on. So every script that I wrote, I really focused in on my characters. I have to say that my dedication to the competition kind of like waned a little bit as the year went by. At first, I really took my time in writing these scripts and I would, you know, research, I would kind of develop these ideas, I would slowly write it. And by the end of it, I got I got good, but I also got super lazy and I left everything to the last minute. So for example, if the deadline was on Monday, for example, I would start writing the script on Friday and I developed a course on how to write a script in 10 days, just because I got so good at this. I wrote a science fiction in three days. And actually that was my best script. And I realized that I really enjoyed writing science fiction. So even when it came to writing the family film, I kind of included elements of science fiction and it was really awesome. And I'll tell you why, because when I went to film festivals and I was going to film markets, and I was kind of navigating and seeing what it was all about. I had like eight scripts in my little satchel bag, you know, and people would say, oh, uh, we're looking for a family film. It's quite fun. It's quite unique. Do you have any ideas? And I'm like, oh yeah, actually I've got one of those, you know? And so it really gave me like an armory to work with. Also one script that I really enjoyed writing was a horror film script. It was mm, a little caca poo poo at the time, but they gave me the feedback. I went back, I worked on it. I went to a film festival. I sent it to a producer who was interested in horror and guess what? We ended up working together and we're still working together. Now we are developing that script. We are actually looking for the financing for that script. So great things can come of it. Any 
budding filmmakers out there, any script writers out there, if you want to master your craft and really improve, I highly recommend that you take part in any of these competitions. I'm not saying take a whole year out and dedicate a whole year to it like I did, but you know, I have eight scripts to show for it and now I just keep writing and it's so much easier for me and I improve every single time I write. So I recommend it for you as well. Whenever you have time, just sit down, try to write these scripts, try to use that deadline because deadlines really push you forward. The aim was not to win. And I remember when I wrote my first script and I submitted it and I joined the Facebook group, there was a woman there and she said, oh, well, you should look at the list of screen craft winners. Um, none of them are people of color, so you don't even have a chance. And I was like, okay, okay, yeah, maybe that sucks. But I said, that's not the point. I'm not there to win. I'm there to grow and I'm there to learn. And I want to use it to my benefit. The more you write, the better you get at it. The more scripts you read, the more you understand. And I never used to believe that. And I actually really dislike reading, but you know, it worked, it worked for me. So I highly recommend it for you. Thank you so much for watching everyone. Take care till next time. Bye.